In this video, I'm going to give you some very important tip for your Web3 career. We're gonna go through some job description of Web3 job and I'm gonna help you understand how you can maximize your chances of getting these jobs. If you don't know me, I'm Julian and on Eat The Blocks, I help Web2 developers to get into Web3. So this is Crypto Job List. This is one of the most famous job board for Web3 jobs. So I suggest to use this website when you want to apply to Web3 jobs. Uh, so we're going to go through a couple of job description there and I try to understand uh, what kind of developer are uh, required. Uh, so let's start with this one, senior uh, front-end engineer at uh, INSEP protocol. So we strive to be the Robin Hood of DeFi. So this is a pretty ambitious project. So it's always important to understand the project itself before you apply and see if you really like it. Um, so then we have the job description here. Uh, so your responsibility, build well-tested front-end and back-end system for our core web product. Okay, so it means that they need someone with both front-end and back-end skills. So a uh, full-stack developer, well-tested. So that means you uh, need to have some experience here. Uh, articulate a long-term technical direction for maintaining and scaling our web product. Okay, so here it will be really, really critical that you show uh, them that you know how to scale product. Um, and here, Sheffer Technical Infrastructure Product Roadmap. Okay, so here you will need to show some leadership for this position. Uh, here, uh, let's see, uh, React and TypeScript. Yeah, so TypeScript now is becoming more or less a standard for a senior front-end position um, and ability to understand uh, expand complex ID to stakeholder yeah so this since this is quite senior you'll have to communicate with different people in the team uh, and work with uh, Solana so here very important detail um, and here the important part experience architecting and building scalable web 2 or web 3 product all right and after nice to have so this is not as important as the other stuff um and i think that this is a company that can pay well um because here they say we can match any offer you have so it looks like a pretty solid company uh for someone who want to apply to a senior position all right so let's get back to crypto job list homepage and we'll see uh, all the jobs. So here product management is not really uh, about development, marketing, yeah, blockchain engine developer. Okay, so this is blockchain core development. Uh, so this is really low level and pretty hardcore. So uh, I'm going to skip this because on Eat the Blocks, we're more focused on blockchain app development. Uh, here, Front-end developer, uh, desktop React um, at Lisk. Okay, so I think this one is a little bit more junior compared to what we saw before. So Lisk is a blockchain and they want a front-end developer. Okay, so here implementation of design specification from UI UX. Yes, this is pretty senior for a junior to uh, intermediate developer, uh, debugging, uh, bug fixing. Okay, so this is how uh, you can stand out in an interview also a uh, unit and uh, integration testing right requirement and here also you probably need to know electron since they're looking for someone to do desktop uh, also react native and if you know Lisk and bitcoin uh this is uh nice to have but not st strictly necessary all right so let's get back to the home page and of uh, crypto job list and do a few other job description here senior backend developers so uh, let's see what they want so uh, some time for backend developer if you know python uh, it's easier to be more credible as a backend developer uh, vibe network so i don't know this project um, so when you read the description of a project it's good to try to understand if this is a web 2 project that is getting into web 3 or if it's a project that is more web 3 native like for example uh, a DeFi protocol or a dao uh, and this really depends on your preference uh, okay so here eight years of experience 
architecture and developing backend systems. So here you need to be pretty senior. Strong experience with Python and JavaScript. So here Python will be really critical. Uh, yeah, and so you also need to have a uh, good experience with uh, cloud systems. All right, so not much detail here. So when you don't have a lot of information like this, it actually make it harder to prepare yourself for uh, this job. Um, so here, lead full stack Web3 developers. I would say this is an intermediate kind of position. Um, so probably someone with uh, three to five years of experience. Uh, so what kind of company is this? Web3 Jobs. Okay, so I think Web3 Jobs is actually a competitor to crypto job list. Um, so it's another job board for crypto. So here actually the business model would be mainly Web2. Uh, so you don't need a lot of knowledge in Web3 actually. Uh, optimize web application to maximize speed and scalability. So since this is a job board, you will need to make a fast website that can handle a high volume of traffic. So they will be interested uh, if you know framework like a Next.js, uh, server-side rendering for SEO, yeah, mobile optimization, SEO would be very important. They also want React here. Okay, so this is not really Web3. This is more like a traditional uh, Web2 role. So let's get back to the home page and to a last listing. Um, all right, so let's try to find a solidity position. Um, let's see, blockchain developer solidity. So here you probably need to be very good with security. So we're looking for blockchain developer solidity, uh, implementing smart contract. And you also need to know some blockchain API and, and who is this company? I own group fintech business in the Middle East. Okay, so I don't know this company. Okay, so in general, when you find job description like this from companies that aren't very famous, it means that the competition is going to be lower. So if you're struggling to get some response, it can be a good idea to reach out to them. Uh, but I'm not sure if they're able to pay really well. Okay, so here they mentioned client smart contracts. So I'm guessing this is an agency that works for some other customers. So in general, agency, uh, it's easier to get a job at this kind of company, uh, but on the CV, it doesn't look as good as if you were working directly for a company that have their own product. It also means that uh, at this kind of company, you get less guidance because sometimes they just drop you in a team and you have to be efficient right away. So, so don't expect too much guidance from this kind of company. Okay, so here they mention a lot of things, but what really matters here to really prove yourself as a spot contract developer is here spot contract gas optimization and skills uh, in security. Well, they really mention a lot of stuff. But I think if you're an intermediate to beginner spot contract developer, you can probably apply to this job. All right, so that was it for this review of job description for Web3. Hey, I'm curious, what did you think of the format of this video? Was it interesting? Let me know in the comment down below if you enjoyed the video. That's it for today. Bye.